How you making, Bone Gang? Vinny here. We're not in uh, we're not in Louisiana anymore right now, buddy. I'm telling you, I can see through the water uh, way more than four inches normally can. We're in the salt, not the brackish, the salt. I'm down here with my boy Heath from Yak Tribe, and uh, I'm trying to get on a snook. If you don't know what that is, that's what it looks like. Never caught one. We don't have them in Louisiana, but that is the goal. Starting off with some top water today, and uh, hopefully don't get eaten by a shark. Anyway, those are mangroves. Don't have those back home either. Apparently that is where the snook are gonna be hiding underneath. We gotta throw that top water right along the edge and they should come on out and snatch it up. Got a mouth just like a largemouth bass, apparently. At least that's what the picture looks like, so. We shall see. That's interesting. Water's boiling with bait. Ah, oh, they definitely got just as many mosquitoes here as they do back home. What is that? Oh, a little tiny fish. That's cool. Oh, that didn't work out as well as I had hoped. Try that one again. It smells funny. And they got all kinds of little fish up in here. It's amazing when you can see everything, how different it is. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right in the mangrove. Oh, oh. oh that hurt. Please don't. Okay. Oh, cheese hum. Starting out with a bang. What is that smell? That certainly ain't no swamp mud, but it's it it stings. I kinda like it. Ooh, I heard it. Oh, you got the net. This is a decent one. You want me to come get it? Um, yeah, we're gonna that net. Sorry, bro. No, you good. I heard the pop when he hit it. Did you? That's a red? Oh, you got him? Yeah. Okay. All right. Nice. We good. Nice. Oh. How'd that happen? That's not good. I just slang my whole eater off. Bait went flying. I have to go get that back. This is going to be a mess. Yeah, I got to go find the bait. <laughs> I slung the lure. Oh, just yeah, I think I got caught in too many mangroves. Like it probably here. it probably nicked the uh it's up it's right around there somewhere in the water. No, it's really it's right in front of me. You, you actually ran over it. There we go, fish on! Fish on! Oh it's a snook! It's a snook! It's a snook! It's a snook! Oh yeah buddy! It's a snook! It's a snook! Alright. Come on, baby, get in the boat. Get in the boat. Get in the boat. Get in the boat. No, 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 no. Come on. Come on. Yes! Got one. Yeah. All right. Fish on, baby. Look at this, dude. Got my first snook. Look at that. Oh, dude. I've been wanting to catch one. Yeah, man, got him in the boat. All right, stand by. Heck yeah, dude. Okay, 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 okay. I don't need I don't need you to hook me. I don't need to be hooked by my first snook. All right, he's heading over here to take a picture of me and my first snook. I'm gonna keep him in the water like this though, in the net and with the grabber so I don't lose him at all. But uh, I wanna make sure he stays good and healthy because you can't keep him right now. Uh, I don't know if there's a season for him. I have to ask Heath, but I know he said we can't keep any to eat or else I would do the catching cook for you guys. You know I would do it because I wanna know what they taste like. But apparently they had a rough time over the past few years and they're trying to bring them back, so. That's awesome! Do whatever you want. Woo, woo! Boy's ready to go. Y'all check out that lateral line on this thing. Ain't no mistaking where that's at. Nice and black, yellow tails, yellow fins. So why can't we keep these? Like they, uh. Yeah, they're just out of season. Um, so y'all do have a season for where you can keep one? Uh, yeah, we keep do, one? yep. And the, and the slot is real small too, but I believe until the end of all, October. There you go. Like Anyways, yeah, we got the slot, but we had a freeze. When I was growing up here, as a kid, we had a bad freeze. It killed a ton of fish. It killed a ton of snook. And so, um, yeah, we lost a lot of snook. And then, of course, we always get hit with red tide and stuff like that. And so the snook population, and then, of course, illegal harvest was right. not helping. Because um, once people found out they taste good, 
the yeah, vegetables started wiping skin them. off like they're delicious. That's what happened with the redfish in Louisiana. Exactly. They used to be trash fish, yeah. you know. Um, but then, yeah, man, uh, it just became, it became hard to catch and we didn't have the numbers. And so now we're back at it. We're good, but we're still not harvesting except for twice a year. And it's only for a few months and the slot is real thin. How many you can just except keep that, we'll give one when slot. you can keep them? Yeah, one. Yeah. And you have to have this, the permit as well. When I was in high school, dude, oh look, there's one following it. There's what? There's three of them following it. What? Snook. Oh yeah. Dude, it was schooled up on it. Come on back. Holy crap, dude. Is a manatee? No, a manatee? It's a sea cow. It's literally right in front Oh, yeah, I see him now. Jeez, him. What's up, buddy? Dude, that's awesome. It's like a cow, only different. These are so friendly. But they can also murky really quick. Crazy. That's awesome. Well, that would make some good videos. Dude, that is so cool, man. Are they endangered or anything, or just protected? Just protected. I honestly don't know if they're endangered. I don't think they are. I mean, I don't know how they could be. I see them everywhere. Whenever right. I go. Dude, that is just so cool. Oop, I heard it. I heard one. Oh, there's a red fish right underneath me. He followed it up to the boot. Oh, what is that? A sheep head? Holy crap, there's a school of sheep head. This place is insane. They had a redfish follow it. And a whole mess of sheep head. You know what I need to do is get this other thing. Where's it at? There we go. Gotta get this swim beat ready to go. That way I can follow up next time that happens. Toss it right in front of his face. Oh, I heard you. I heard you. Let's see if you want some of this. Oh, not in the right spot, but you know, maybe we'll call you out with it. Huh? Denabel? Sounds like a Denabel to me. Yeah, I'm gonna put it right in your face. How about now? How about now? Come on, come on. Man, I know you there and you just, you just showed me. And no. God dang it. Holy smokes. This place is a junk. Thing scared the crap out of me. There we go. Fish it one. Another snook. Woo! Jeez! <laughs> it's like a little baby tarpon. <laughs> come here, you. Oh, come here. <laughs> oh, that's fun. That's, hey, that's my fish. That's so much fun. Dude, he ate that whole bait. That whole bait is in his mouth. I'm gonna have to get the pliers for that for sure. Dude, these things eat so cool. I mean, just knocked it down. Look at that. He wanted that thing. Jeez. <laughs> Dude, that is so much fun. That is awesome. These fish are cool, man. Oh, I wish we had these in Louisiana. No. <laughs> well, <laughs> I guess I do about the same. I guess I'm just as good at holding these as I am redfish. Come here, brother. Come here. Give me that lip. Give me that lip. Go. All right. I got you now. All right. Let's get a picture with you. All right, buddy. Let's get you back in the water. Well, you're ready to go. Look at it. Let go of my thumb. You could take off if you let go of my thumb. Drop it. No, like, let it go. <laughs> what are you doing? There you go. Get on out of here. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, I'm loving this. This is nice. I like it. This is nice. All right, we made it back to Heath's house. I only managed to squeeze out two snook, but that was the goal, so that was accomplished. Luckily, Heath got this redfish, so now we'll be able to uh, have some grub, make this a good old catch and cook. That's right. Heath likes to make, uh, he likes to cut up the redfish throat. Mm -hmm. I don't even, I don't even know what part is the throat. Right here. It's just like a, like a So I already bled them, I already bled them earlier. There's some ice in there still. So I already bled them, and then we're gonna cut this collar. So from here to here, we're gonna eat that as well. Saw bug. We got dog collar, smell like all this. Yep. Some pepper. Simple, man. Salt. Season, yeah, I got some. But I'm gonna do something special at the end. I'm gonna do something special at the end. Something you've never had on redfish before. What that is? This is a secret sauce. Super secret? Super secret. Did you make that sauce yourself? No. Well, then it's not that secret. I bought it myself. It's made in the Philippines, how about that? You right. made that sauce then? Right, you like this sauce, right? Which one? This one, the orange one. Uh, yeah. Is it really delicious or is he lying to me? Yeah. Bagano? Watch yourself, buddy. Alright, we got... Redfish throat, we got Filipino egg rolls, and uh, white rice. rice. Some jasmine rice. So let's see what this throat, what this throat tastes like. I'm, I'm assuming it tastes just like regular redfish, right? Now here it goes. That's pretty good. That's good. Uh, pretty good. It's good. Definitely gonna be keeping the throats from now on. Mm -hmm. I try these, these egg rolls. Nothing uh, crazy I need to worry about in these egg rolls, huh? Neutral. Yeah, well now that would be delicious. Mm hmm That's real good. You like it? Mm-hmm. Alright guys, well thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button if you like it. Subscribe if you have it. And uh, catch you guys on the next adventure.